hello everybody welcome back to the channel in this section I will show you some tricks for joining fields from two files in different ways using the join key function of DF sort let's suppose a customer comes and asks the following question that I have two files with a key in bytes 1 to 3 and data in bytes 5 to 9 so now the file has the following records you can see from 1 to 3 is the key and from 5 to 9 is the data. Similarly, in file B has the following same records with 1 to 3 as key and from 5 to 9 as data. Customer says I want to join the data fields for pair of record with same key to get the following output. So for example, at key number 001 in file A and file B the customer wants the data to be formatted in such a way that for that key the data are aligned in a single line. So this can be achieved using the join key function of DF sort. Can I do this using the DF sort utility? The answer is yes. So let us see how this can be done. Coming back to my main frame, I'll show you the input files which I have already set up file number A and file B. Let's see the data inside file A. So yes, the file inside the data, the data inside the file has 1, 2, 3 as the key and 5, 2, 9 as the data. Let's see now the data inside file B. 1, 2, 3 as the key and 5, 2, 9 is the data. Okay, sure. So let us begin with typing in the df sort utility. So I'll type the step name as join key one. This will execute the sort program. direct our sys out data to this pool area file a will be the input file dd dsn this will be our file a let us put in the disposition share mode. Similarly, we have file B. We want the out file which will reformat the data as, as shown. It will be a PS file. Now let us define the tracks. So now I will define the control statement.
so we'll define the field which we'll be using to join keys would be join keys comma f1 we'll define here the td name then the field would be 1 2 3 alphanumeric let's sort this file similarly we'll define a join key for file 2 that is file b fields will be the same reformat reformat fields and the data from the file 1 located position 1 we want the data from file 2 at location 5 comma 5 in such and then we'll select the option to copy the data and outfill it outfill f names equals to out and we'll build the format as 1 comma 9 comma 1 space comma 10 comma 5 close the GCL let us save this and submit ok so there is a GCL error let's check in the spool what is the error invalid numeric in space field so there is an invalid at line number six statement number six this has to be trk not trks save this and submit now okay so there is an error of max cc 16 why is this showing max is 16? Okay, so so there is an error saying that the comma is invalid. So the dollar sign at this position so shows that there is an error at this particular value in the JCL. So let me fix this error and we'll rerun it. So it's a good thing that I make mistake and you get to learn. So that is what is my goal over here to make you learn more. And also I get to understand that I'll need to be more aware next time. Like join keys, then there is a space instead of a comma. Let us save this and submit. still there is an error so guys we are getting max is here 16 and as i saw in the output it says that the out file that is our output files record format is fixed block and its record length is of 80 but the output f name is reformatting it to a record length of 15 hence the record length 15 and 80 does not match that's why it's giving max 16 so one thing to be noted over here is whenever we are using a record format of fixed block then the record length should be same as that of the outfield that we are building in the join key reformat dfs.utility so here there is a 15 byte of outfield that is 15 record 15 bytes of record length is been outputted to the output file hence the file has to have that same parameters also if the parameters differ then there would be a data mismatch error and to avoid that we'll uh, create an output file with a record length of 15 and now let's execute it
so now we have a max is as 0 let us check if the data is outside the output file is, is as expected or not ok so you can see the data in the output file and for this particular key O00 sorry 001 has a data AAA from file A and data BBB from file B so with the help of join key we were able to combine the data of two different files using the same key into a single file that is 0001AAA and BBB so this much is for today's video if you have any doubt comment inside the comment section share the video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys for watching